The Bird Bros back at it again, heading up north. These guys don't quit, because it's us. Picking Sean up. That's AM. Grabbing me in the morning. It's a beautiful day. Turn that shit off. We got Bird Bro fan, Dave. Yeah, right. I was lucky enough to win a raffle. Uh, it was one in a thousand chance, but I won a raffle to spend a day with the Bird Bro, so I'm pretty excited. Way to go, Dave. Rock on. We wanted to leave at like 9 or 10, but Dave was just like, no, let's go at 5 a.m. And we were like, all right, buddy, let's do it. Let's see the birds. Gotta get some caffeine in us. Gotta get some gas, though, before we get on the road. And she's all topped up. Time for some bird bro trivia. Yeah. Which sex of old squaw can be identified by long needle-like tail? Male. Male. Male, female, or both? Male. Male. at the surface dive of water. Under, dive under water. John? What are the options? Uh, dabbles at the surface of the water, dives underwater, or forages on land. Oh, it dives underwater. It does dive underwater. What is the primary source of food for the surf scooter? Mollusks. Mollusks. During the winter. And invertebrates. Yeah, mollusks. Yeah, you guys got it. That's an expert question. I didn't even bring the question. Algonquin Park. The largest provincial park in all of Ontario. This park here has like a variety of birds in the winter time. That was a raven. Raven? You can know you know it's a raven because crows are not found in Algonquin in the winter. Oh, I thought it's because it likes clubbing in ecstasy. Oh, get the bird seed ready guys. Hi, I'm Sean from the Bird Bros. I'm here with Dave, our raffle winner for the Bird Bros Excursion of a Lifetime. We're here in Algonquin Park, midwinter, looking for birds. Gotta stock up on bird seed. The bird seed here is uh, black oil sunflower seeds, a favorite of the birds. It's like crack to them. 30%. Not butt crack, no. <laughs> oh, gross. <laughs> I feel like I'm... Mm. Setting up franchises all around. There we go. It's got some bird seed there. Now let's find some birds. Oh! Oh, that was a male hairy woodpecker. You can tell it's a male because of the red mark on the top of its head. Females do not have the red mark. And they're definitely slightly bigger than a downy woodpecker. Oh, we got a red-breasted nuthatch. That we do. The Bird Bros. Bird Experience. All that nature has to offer. Dave is getting the best treatment, aren't you, Dave? Absolutely, Sean. I'm so glad I won this raffle. It's the best experience I've ever had. That's a red-breasted nuthatch. Oh, well, there's some uh, grouse footprints. Maybe a spruce grouse. Oh, there it is! That's not a spruce grouse, John. That looks looks more rough. That's a rough grouse. I've seen that before, but still cool. Look at that posture it has there. Twerking. Oh. It's a twerker. The, 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 the rough around its neck. And the tail spread out there is its uh, warning posture. Telling us to skedaddle. One of the more common birds to be shot and killed by hunters, as they apparently taste delicious, especially with a deep fryer. I would never eat a bird. <laughs> All right, just followed what I thought was a spruce gross. No, it's just a rough gross. Still cool, I got a bit of footage, but 
not exactly what we're looking for, but I kind of wandered off and got separated from everyone. I'm in the middle of the forest. I'm just following my footsteps back. But I just lost them. Sure is winter time. Can't deny that. Oh, what's that? Well, that would be a red squirrel. That previous guy, Neville, counts squirrels. I'll add that to my count. Yeah. I'll add that to his count. What's yeah. that? 27 for you today? 27 squirrels? We look at birds, Neville looks at squirrels. Oh, what's that bird there, John? Well, that's the that's national bird of Canada, the gray jay. What a slick bird. Uh -huh. Algonquin Park is probably the most southern place you can find a gray jay, as it is found throughout all of Canada, except for southern Ontario. So here in Algonquin Park, you can catch them yeah. quite regularly. Yeah. They breed here in the park. Oh, now we're at the visitor center. The visitor center here gets a lot of traffic from people and birds. <laughs> Checking out these bird feeders. Hopefully to find some bird action. And would you look at that. Black oil, sunflower seeds. Everybody knows. Oh, look, a flock of evening grosbeaks. beaks. Rose beaks kind of have like this thing on the top of their head. They look kind of like Data from Star Trek. Jordy? Jordy? This gray one here is a female evening grosbeak. beak. Not quite as colorful as the yellow male grosbeak beak like this one here. Look at that yellow on the forehead. That's distinctive of the evening grosbeak. beak. It's not a tumor. Hey, look at Dave. Look at that joy. Joyous face. Say the joyous face of our contest winner here. This is your uh, male purple, purple finch. finch. Jinx! Bird. Oh, you owe me a pop. This is purple finch. It's uh, got a very red tone to it, which is odd because it's called a purple finch. Mm -hmm. The feathers of these birds help them stay warm all through the winter. Fluffing its feathers there to help it keep warmer. This is the female, uh, less colorful and more more drab. The finches are defined by uh, their actual their beak shape. Uh, is a good way to tell finch. Mm -hmm. Uh, they, they like to eat uh, the buds off of trees and you can see that they they chew it from the side of their beak to help get the stuff from the inside. Gotta get that stuff. Oh, what's that down on the ground? Oh, there's your crossbills. Crossbill? Whoa! Didn't get the greatest footage, but you can see its bill is sort of crossed. Their crossbills have evolved to be crossed so that they can get the seeds within the pine cones. Yeah, the only bird that can get them. So Dave? I was seeing the rough grouse in the forest there. It was great. I had two options. One, I could have taken the $1,400 or the Bird Bros experience. And I'm really glad that I went with the Bird Bros experience. Nice. Neville, how's taking along for the ride there, bud? Uh, it was good. It was funny to see you guys go chase after a land bird. Oh, wobbly dobbly. Oh, John just farted. <laughs> well, that's all for the bird bros here in Algonquin Park. Saw lots of interesting bird species. Yeah. Bird bros. And, uh, we gotta thank Davey for coming on out. Hope you had a blast there, bud. See you guys later. Make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and uh, be our friends. And feel free to leave a comment. Yeah. Let us know how you thought of the episode.